What's going on YouTube? Official Keith here. And today I want to share with you a service that I use on the reg called IndieFlix. And as you can see on the screen, it's content with a purpose. Find movies, documentaries, shorts, and TV that start conversations. So this is more for the person that's into the indie filmmakers um, and the content that they have to share. And I wanted to go ahead and share a little bit about this with you today. So let's go ahead and get into it. First, we'll start off with the login. Login is simple and easy. You can either use your email address or you can sign in through Facebook. Either one will work. So let me go ahead and sign in right now. Now that we're logged in, I'm gonna tell you briefly about some of the options that are available from this menu, starting with that quick pick button. Basically, the quick pick button will string together a list of content and show you 15 seconds of each content. That way it gives you an, uh, an idea as far as if you want to watch that particular piece or not. And you do have the option uh, to fast forward to the next piece of content. On this screen, you can see my list and you can also see where it says recommended for keep. My list, just content that I've added to my list to watch later. Recommended for keep is stuff that I've already watched and what it thinks I would like to watch. Now the cool thing with some of the um, you know some of the movies and documentaries that are on here if you hover the mouse over the particular splash cover art of um, any any content that's on here it'll always give you the option to add to my list but some of them will have the option to do a quick pick by clicking on the quick pick button if it's available and again remember what we talked about in the last screen quick pick being 15 seconds of the particular content uh, so it'll show you 15 seconds also, it'll show you those 15 seconds right then and there. So it won't move you to another screen or, you know, whatever. It'll just do it right then and there. So that's a pretty cool option. If you look where that yellow box is, you'll see three options there. Any genre, any duration, and more. So basically, any genre is just what that is. So if you like action and adventure, uh, animations, foreign films, horror, sci-fi whatever the case may be you can select from there and then it'll only show um, movies and documentaries of that particular genre the next option is any duration so you can pretty much pick any duration or you can pick 0 to 5 minutes 0 to 15 minutes 15 to 60 minutes or 60 plus minutes so if you only had let's say a 15 minute break you want to catch something real quick you can do it or if you want if you only want to take five minutes you can do that too I mean they make it really easy and simple uh, to use the service that last option is the more option you see how the any genre and any duration has its own buttons you can also add the country and the audience so if the audience is a you know family then you add that as a button or if you want to pick a particular country you can add that as a button and then you would have those options to help filter out uh, new things to watch and to discover. IndieFlix is available on Apple TV, Roku, almost any smartphone, PC, tablet, Mac, you name it, you're covered. All right, so we're pretty much at the end of the video. Um, but I want to say that IndieFlix didn't pay me to make this video or voice my opinions about IndieFlix service. I just wanted to put this video out there to let you know that there is a great alternative out there uh, when it comes to watching content, especially of the, uh, the independent variety. Uh, so big shout out to IndieFlix for doing this. Um, I did reach out to them just to see if they would be willing to provide uh, a promotion code for my subscribers and thanks to my friend Gina over at IndieFlix, um, it's, it's happening. So instead of getting the normal 14 day free trial, what I want you to do is to go to www.indieflix.com forward slash promo. When you land on that page on that promo line, just type in official Keith IT and click submit and that will net you a three month trial subscription to IndieFlix. 
but I don't even know why we're tripping because you're going to keep that subscription going even after the three months. That's how much you're going to enjoy the service. As always, this is your man, Official Keith here. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Uh, that redeem link that I just mentioned, I will throw that down below so you can just click on it, put in Official Keith IT in the code box, and have at it. And enjoy those, uh, enjoy that content, especially the documentaries. Uh, enjoy it all. Until next time, we'll see you later.